Okay, everyone, here's the garden tour. So here are the saplings that we planted last year and they're still alive. That one's a river birch and that one's a red bud and I don't really know what the other two are. Um, in this corner, we have corn, which will be new this year. Then I have a row of zucchini and I hope that I gave them enough space this year. Then I have this little area of all different kinds of peppers because I just kept buying more, which is weird because I don't even like peppers, but I do like using them for salsas and stuff. So we have some jalapenos, um, pepperoncini, which are so good and I've never seen them before um, to grow. So I'm excited about that. Then we have a little row of eggplant because those usually stay more um, contained. I got some broccoli just to try. Um, there's some spinach. Um, back here are some onions, which I've never done, and cilantro. Um, hopefully I'm gonna get some lettuce for here. Then we have way too many tomatoes. So I got a bunch of different varieties of tomatoes, but I now know the difference between determinant and indeterminate. So now I have these huge cages thanks to my mom and more knowledge on how to prune things. But I have one, two, three, four, five indeterminate ones. And then I have a thing of plum tomatoes, which are determinant. And then two Roma tomatoes, which are determinant. And then I have this planter full of different kinds of basil. Um, and then we have like the cucumber area. I'm gonna see if I can try to train the cucumbers to go up that palette. And I'm gonna get another palette for here. That one is supposedly a bush type cucumber and then a whole bunch of dill for the pickles. So of course, now that I've put all of this thought into this and think that I know more than I did last year, We'll see if anything actually grows this year, but thanks to Scott, we got a lot done. None of this was here earlier, like a few days ago.